Ich gehöre längst nicht mehr zur Welt der Sterblichen. Ich fürchte hier nichts und niemand. Willst du wissen, wer ich bin? Ich bin Vegeta! Hello guys, it's Shockwave King. <laughs> and I'm back again. And yes, yes, you saw that title. Yes, if there was ever a Xenoverse 2. Not Xeno fuck, I fucked that up. If there ever was a Shinobi Strikers 2. I'm not one of those individuals who hate this game. I'm not one of the individuals who think this game is a piece of shit. I do see very high potential inside this game. The problem is they fucked up on the execution like they're a bunch of fucking retards. I I'll get into my problem with that, but it's just basically if there was ever a Xenoverse 2, right? If there was a Shinobi Strikers 2, cause let's be honest, that, that's what it is. It's Naruto so with, the, with the Xenoverse slapping onto it. You get to create a character. You can do solo missions. You can do co op with your friends. Let's not try to act like this is not what it is, alright? If you want to argue some bullshit, take your ass somewhere else, alright? But if there ever was a Shinobi Strikers 2, one of the main things that I have to fix, alright, I could go into some increase and make the game better. But what I know the number one problem is the combat. And the bullshit camera. This is the problem the game has played it ever since it came out. Okay, number one, but let me tell you a little bit of history. I was one of those people when this game came out. I, I wiped my ass with this goddamn game. I roasted and dosed this motherfucker. Cause my, my, my love for Naruto pretty much died during the uh, fourth great ninja war. That arc was kind of everything after that was excellent. Then that war came out and it was just the aliens showed up and. And, and it's some of the some of the plot, and you got you got Naruto, Jesus, and it's it, it's no no no. But uh, when I first saw this game, I was roasting the fuck out of it. All right, if you ever played uh, if you ever play that PSP game called Naruto Kazumi Drive, it basically looked the exact same thing. And for months, months, I was roasting the fuck out of this game. All right, nonstop, I was throwing this game under the bus. But you know, I heard people talk about it, and you, know, you hear this and that. Free demo. I, I tried. I played it for some months before I recently just bought it. And it's just it, it's, it's an all right product. Right? It's a product that needs some extreme creasing. But one of the key problems is that it got the same Xenoverse one problem, but even worse. At least the camera in Xenoverse fucking work. This one just halfway commit suicide when you get hit, and then when you try to lock onto the one person who was just whooping your ass, it will lock onto somebody totally different. I don't understand what type of drugs. To or what type of crack they were smoking when I was making this game. But how do you have a game with such potential? With such potential? Like you could drag this game up for years just slap it on updates and story mentions. Well, the one thing I, I can't hate are fuckers who are greedy who don't want to put in a goddamn work. Because when you put in the fucking work, you make money. But every goddamn... I gotta calm down. But uh, yeah, yeah. It, the camera is retarded. All right, it needs some help. It, it needs to be fixed. It's one of those things where it, it, it's not a game. All right, no, no, it has been a complaint for months. Had, had they shut, had they, had they shut up to try to fix it? I thought that when, when I played it, that's some months later I had to update the game. And maybe they fixed it. No, it's just is garbage. So just because they come into the game and the camera to be any better. No, and all of the gameplay it just, you know, to a certain degree, as much as I despise the universe. I, I do have some good time doing it, alright? I do have some times to play with my own personal creative character. I'm not gonna act like I never did. I'm not gonna act like I never 100% despise and hate the universe and never had a good moment in it. And I'm all depressed. I don't think I do get picked on, get picked on. And it's just, no. No. I enjoyed the game. I had a good time with the game. The problem is, you get air comboed, then air comboed again, and then you get smashed against the goddamn wall, then you get fireballed back to back. It's it, it, it's not fun. All right, there's no way to escape it. Like he was getting your ass jumped by the computer or multiple people in Xenoverse. You just gotta sit there and get raped, you just get violated. You can't do a goddamn thing. Another thing, I don't know why they broke it up in the classes like this. Cause it's just like the classes does not make the game better, in my personal opinion. The game would be ten times better without classes, but have the jutsus itself be able to put you into a class. Now you want to have classes with special moves maybe, but it's, that's not even really necessary. You just put up, give people some ninjutsu, gives you the way to upgrade those ninjutsus, and you basically solve your entire goddamn problem. And shit, would it make the game a perfect product? No. But it'd be ten times better than the product you got now. 
I know something, I know thing with the combat. At least Xenoverse tried to give you an illusion that you could do some type of combos with your character. This one doesn't attempt to try. You you just you just button mash buttons. You spit out then juice you back to back in your button mash and pray to God you get to the ultimate juice boost for somebody else does. Or pray to God you're gonna hit with an infinite combo that's back to back like you playing Xenoverse fucking two and you can just back attack, back attack, back attack, back attack. I I got sick of getting backhanded in that goddamn game. Right, there's no way to stop someone doing the back attack. So this is an infinite goddamn combo. Same thing in this game. You get your ass whooped in the air. You get you get just get raped across the goddamn map. Slapped around. They rape you some more. Slap you around and one hit KO you, punk ass. They need to fix the gameplay. All right. They need to refine the combat. I need to refine the combat from God of War 2018. Got a problem? There's fresh concrete outside. It is one of the things they need to fix. They plan on making another Naruto game like this. Could I have been collecting data and feedback? But it just could it have killed the Naruto game franchise? Who knows? I'm not a specialist at this, Aaron. But all I know is I just I, I see a game with grave potential go straight down the shitter for no apparent goddamn reason. It's just why? Why? But that's the gameplay combat. Now one thing, I can't recall completely you can't really play this game offline, alright? That makes sense for the demo. But for the full game, there's real no, there's no real offline missions per se. There's there's not 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 much. It, it, they, they give you some shit, but let's be honest, it, 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 it's a joke. You don't get anything from it. You just you just do it, go around, and, and that's the biggest potential. You could actually have to store this game and share it. Then that'd be a universe, or like the One Punch Man game that went straight down. We'll, we'll get to that fucking game. No, but it's just like you can just literally just have you being some type of leaf ninja, setting as it going through the main story, and sure would it be different stories depending on what clan you go to. Yes, but it's not impossible. All right, if, you, if people would stop being goddamn lazy, it's not fucking impossible. All right. If I had the team and the development and the funding, I would fix this goddamn shit, my damn self. But uh, yeah. Then all the story missions are bad. The one that gets done, I just I recently enjoyed that. And I've not yet to go to all the, not the story missions, go through all the missions themselves. Or try a co-op, so I'm not gonna give my input on that. But uh another thing that if there was gonna be a Shinobi Strikers 2 that they need to work on and improve is the Leaf Village. Some might say, I for all the Leaf Villages. Number one, just like punk ass university. One and two, you can't do a goddamn thing. You just stand in there. You're not doing shit. What can you what, what can I hop around the leaf village? It's it's still a hub area. What can I hop around what different will it make? I'm not expecting to attack people. But I'm expecting the spirits no different from a uh, Naruto Storm one. Get to leap around the village, swinging on the fucking line poles, doing trips and tricks, doing the 360 flips, diving and diving. Cause there's no reason. At this point, it's gonna continue to be anime games like this. You have to increase the hub world. There's no reason why people should not improve the hub world and give you some goddamn thing to do. And I'm not saying you have to make it some type of mission spree or turn this into GTA, cause. <laughs> if I get into that, it's, it's gonna cause more problems for myself. But uh, yeah, and more than one thing you can do in the Leaf Billets to make the whole Leaf Billets ten times better than what it is. And these are key things they should actually do. They're gonna make another game. They're gonna try to earn the fans trust back. You should put in that worthy effort into this shit. It, what is better than seeing just some random character taking a nice little jug even 15 feet, being able to do fucking a 360. That would be ten times better. Yeah, that would be ten times better. I'm out of fucking this bitch. But, uh, yeah. It, it's just one of those things where it's just like, why? Fucking why? Why can't you just do these simple things? But, but, and also the substitutions are more or less a joke. Cause like, in this game, another thing with the gameplay, there is no use of chakra. You just spam a bunch of shit. You can't do anything extra with the chakra. You can't hop away across the screen with the chakra. You can't really do too much of shit. The block button is a joke. It's a fucking joke. All right, it, 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 it's not even a game at this point. It is literally a comedy spree. And I wish I was lying. All right, I wish I can just sit here and say, ah, it's good, it's good. Oh, you're not doing too bad, it cost you. No, no, if there's an actual player, it rather go one or two ways. That person will be getting raped, or I'll be getting raped. There, there's no even competition in this goddamn game. You spam a bunch of shit, and that's pretty much it. You're not playing three of things, universe, or anything else. You just, like, you understand, I'll be going 1v1 with my friend in the universe. He just, oh, Big Bang Command Mayha. You could turn that bullshit 360. What? I get insta kill. What? I'm over here trying to pound this man's brain in. Are you going to spam this bullshit? Fight me like a man. But, 
and Xenoverse is still a better product over this one. It is what it is. There's a reason why a lot of anime YouTubers and everybody else have started talking about it. I don't know what type of YouTuber I am. I just make fucking videos, to be honest. Talk about shit, but it, I just can't help to see the grand deal potential in this game just gone to waste. Because that's what it is. It's just going to waste. It's just... I doubt they'll make another game, but this game came out, like, two, two years ago, and it just... Because really... You don't really have to check. You gotta do an overhaul of some of the things, but you got the you got the basic gameplay. What the fuck is you see this bullshit, man? But uh, there's, there's a lot of options. There's a lot of options you can do. Really, it just it's one of those things where it's just like there's so much potential, and it's just like if you just want to do it for the money, goddamn it, do it right. All right, if you're gonna rob me of my money, give me a reason. Another reason. It's just like I'm level 40 on a demo, and my level transfer over. But you know how many fucking ninjutsus I know? Not a goddamn thing. I don't even know how you even fucking get them. I don't know if you want to get in a multiplayer story mode. It's just, I'm going to get my fucking teachings from Madari Chiha. At least Xenoverse got that shit right the first fucking time. And why do you compare it to Xenoverse? Because it's still an anime goddamn game. There's not an excuse because it's a different franchise. If you want to know if people believe that bullshit, then you... I'm, I'm sorry. Go back. Go back to playing the mainstream media games where they slut out the exact same bullshit year after year and a year. But I'm halfway dead. Uh, but a lot of things you can do in this game. A lot of overhaul. Look, look with the weapons. It's just like, let's say you're gonna have a weapon in this game. It's whether you have it all the time or you don't. You really could have added the etched weapons or something that you can do with the uh, triangle button as a hubby button where you're gonna choose hand to hand or just. They have to regulate <laughs> they want to choose us to go through the weapons. I'm also the weapons options are garbage, all right? You get one type of blade from Sasuke, you got the awesome claws, you get also a knuckles, and that's pretty much it. Yeah, you, you get to play with some boxing gloves, you can become a uh, vacant street fighter. Is, is that all you can do, Billy? Is that the best you can do? There's, there's more weapons inside Nara to the net. Stop playing these goddamn games, right? Make a product, then everybody can be happy. You can get money, you can go out to the bankroll and just cash in and make a withdrawal until constantly trying to pray to God you have enough money this week to make it a pot. But uh, yeah, it, it, it's the whole reason why people just don't talk about this game. And the game has lots of potential, but then again, no matter how much of a, a story mode you try to add, no matter how much of a multiplayer you try to add, no matter how much you try to refine the gameplay, it's always going to be one simple premise. Anime games will always be shit. I'm sorry. They'll be garbage. The, the, the era of anime games have died, alright? Ever since then, has been fucking trash. And every single fucking anime fucking watch it. This is what I'm calling myself an anime viewer. I just watch some shit and that shit. Because y'all just slop up this bullshit every single week. And you just buy this shit like it's good. You buy it. You slop that shit up like you just starving for weeks for something. For some other goddamn product. This product be shit, and you still slop that shit up for no goddamn reason. If you stop your pouring this bullshit, maybe they'll try and improve. But no, they never improve. They always make that goddamn money. I understand, alright? You get desperate for a game, alright? You're just waiting for that one game for your favorite series. It could be a comic book, it could be manga or anything. But when as soon as that game turns to shit, you must, you, you must attempt to do something. Try to give them feedback. And if you're a developer, try to make the goddamn game better. Stop wasting everybody's time. Don't halfway make a game, because you're going to make people irritated, untamed, irrational, and then people can play like a death stretch. Uh, do I support people getting death stretch? No. Is there a reason to give death stretch? No. But it's just, uh... Uh, I knew what this game was when it came. Also, the boss is like this. All, all fuck, all he fucking does, all day, every day, all he fucking does, like his punk ass son Gamachi, is just spam the water bullets and that it. Who bullcrammed this fucking AI? The PSP game did ten times better than this bullshit. Somebody say, oh, you bought the game, you knew he was getting it too. To a certain degree, yes. But I'm not gonna act like I, I, I can't give my opinion about this goddamn product. Because there's no reason, no reason I can't do better than this. It's time and again, Cyber Connect do the same shit. The same thing with the Storm franchise. I'm sorry. You some people might like them games. Those are not fighting games. Those are not even casual games either. Those are just pile of shit disguised as a goddamn game. I, I personally don't like them, alright? They're halfway broken. You can just grab span yourself into the infinite. It's, it's just, it, it's, it's not a game, alright? It's not, it, it's basically, to a certain degree, a role playing game. It's not even something you can play casually with your friends. Without some bullshit, everything going the same way. There's no in-depth combos. 
the combo system that it does have is it it it, it, it is what it is. And there was a time, there was a time where little old, little old Mr. Shockbeard King was, uh, he wasn't always like this, I, he used to be more optimistic about certain subjects like this, but it's just like, the, the One Punch Man game just, it, it, it proved that these fuckers didn't learn anything. You make Jump Force, and while, to this date, there is no fucking rematch button. How long since you had rematch buttons, and you take, who, who don't put a rematch button in the goddamn game? People can't be this fucking stupid. And these fuckers get paid. Where's my goddamn paycheck? Some bullshit. If the dollar takes to become a game developer, then I'll be damned. I could become one tomorrow. Just make stupid ass decisions and people will pay for it. Now I'm calling people stupid for just trying to support their favorite product. No. I am calling it con quite concerning. I know when uh, they're able to just have to scrape games on the rug because like they make these mistakes and just move on to another thing. But that's my only problem. It just, uh,. We just scrape it all along the rug. It was a bad game. You, you'll be good the next time around. And I, po I, I, I hate to be that guy to say, Nah, nah, Bobby, nah. Henry from down the street won't get off the drugs. He, quite frankly, might die from it. And the anime game syndrome has just gone down to the shitter. The, the Dragon Ball. The, we have had, had a good Dragon Ball game since. How long ago was that? It was a. Uh, oh, it. Ooh. Ooh, the game before Xenoverse, so then we had that Battle of Z garbage. Ultimate Ticket Issue would just say, had some good elements when it comes to the quick time of it, but it's just simulator mode. Ooh, that's. Ooh. But, uh, yeah, then it's. It, it, I'm, I'm just frustrated that this same bullshit keeps happening time and again. How does it keep happening? You people have been making games for fucking decades. How do you keep fucking up? How do we go from Ultimate Ninja to Storm? Ultimate Ninja to Shinobi Strikers? How do we go from Budokai Chichi and Budokai and Raging Blast and Burst Limit to Xenoverse 2? God damn it. Cause no matter what you can say about them games, whether you like them or not, at least it's fun to play them. Alright, even if you're not trying to beat your friend to death and try to prove who's better, or you're just trying to play a casual game, you get some type of enjoyment. You don't get an enjoyment if something is broken, or you can spam some shit into oblivion. When it came to those games, you wanted to whoop somebody's ass, well besides from Ultimate Ninja, it's, or Ultimate Ninja, it, it, everybody knew, alright? Unless you was a combo beast without using your chakra, you were just waiting for to get that three chakra points, and one more hit, smashing the buttons, continue, smashing the button, continue, it's all over now, Ultimate Sukuyomi! But, uh, in reference to other games, it's just, I, I'm just mad that they, they act like they can't do better. And they could. They very well could. And it's just, there's, there's no excuse. And the thing is, if you expect this game, just like Destiny, or anything else to last over a few years, make a solid, basic foundation. All the rest of the DC can be crash, cash grab shit. As long as you have solid gameplay, some enjoyment, and some customization, that's all you need. This has mostly just been a rampant about a about why why can't I just fix these goddamn games at least in a more bigger leaf village we have fuckers like that just just camping out in the middle of the city just doing that shit like, at least they'll give us some place to go instead of in the spawn place and it just and it, and it just is what it is it is, it is what it is so uh yeah this has been more or less a, a rant than anything else it just uh ooh that's just another way to raise up my goddamn blood pressure it just why do I do this to myself? I don't. What the fuck is all this lag? This is a, I haven't. This is the first time I spent shit like this. Cause I feel like the demo didn't face shit like this. But it's just a. Uh, got things like tournaments. Everything that's from twin is just. I still don't know how to get fucking morning G That that's just my ignorance. All right. I started from the beginning of the video. I thought I'm not some type of Shinobi Strikers beast. So if you wanna roast me up in the comment section. All right. It, it, you potentially can, but it's just I hate when I see potential like this go down the shitter. Now we had a Dragon Ball game, we've had a Naruto game, but can we get a One Piece game and will it do it right? All right, so many Devil Fruits. Now do I have to explain how there be more than one Devil Fruit? But then you have some serious problems. Cause you have people just like this is a one-time thing. You gotta do that. Then you gotta explain armament hockey, and then it's just like what at a certain level you unlock armament hockey, armament hockey, and. It, it could work. Like in the MMO base, you can find a fruit just because, and, and you get it. And it could be like a certain number of people that get the fruit. But, I don't know. 
uh, there, there's just been a good AAA pirate game, and Assassin's Creed 4 is not really an Assassin's Creed game. It's not really a pirate game. I don't know what it is. Is the ship combat terrible? No. Do I enjoy the game? Yes, but I'm not gonna act like it's a pirate game. Cause I can't walk up to a fucking bar, throw someone back with the boys, and joke around. Well, second was two of would have been a, a better one, a better pirate game. But like always, who cares about releasing the game good on the first release? Updates, updates. No Man's Sky updates, updates, and No Man's Sky. But uh, yeah, it's, it's been your boy, Mr. Shockwave King. This has been the, the rants of a raging madman. And uh, only thing I do is wish for the best. And I just, how is Cyber Connect 2 still open? They keep shoving like shit like this. I understand it was good, it was unperformed, but most of the time it's just alright. And it's just, I'd like to have hope for One Piece Power Warriors 4. But it's not really my type of game, really. And I'm not gonna have a played game like that. Because it's based on other versions of Dynasty Warriors. Or, uh, now to open Ninja Impact. But just, I, I don't know. I, I might play at my heart. It's, it's just... I hate seeing potential go straight down and shit. And then, like, there's no point of, you know, right hand, left hand. There's no point of you might have to shoot a particular style for your character. Like, not... Like, like, certain elements are just not... It's just not added in there. And it's, it's just not there for a game like this and it has just potential like this and it's just why why do you play the games like this don't make a game like this you're not gonna go full blown and blown full and blown supporting this game and then when you fully support it you get the money what, what part of that equation game that really built understand you make a good or decent product you make DLC later and throw in some slight micro tragedies. And then it equals money and people playing it for years. It's not a complicated goddamn equation. People acting stupid. These fuckers get paid for the mental retardation. And I just spit out some basic shit and still know I can fucking do it. But then again, thank God no one watched this video or get to this part of the video in the first place. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's just been a, a very angry, angry individual. Raising up his blood pressure and it's just uh, everything else in between. This video could be an epic fail, you know, it depends if, uh, of me unplugging out the microphone if it fucked anything up or not. Well, yeah, I've been your boy, Mr. Shockwave King. Hope you enjoyed it. If there ever was a Shinobi Strike is through, how would you make your version of the game? Would you think the game needs some improvements? And what, what areas would you improve it on? Well, it's been your boy, Mr. Shockwave King. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you subscribed after my channel's budget. But it is what it is. Peace.